I'm Holly McLean, and I live at Rumble Ridge, which is a 10-acre property above El Jamel. And um, we turned the water on from the irrigation reservoir above us with the Mountain Meadow Reservoir Company that gave permission to give us water. And as we left the property, um, my thought was when we return in the morning, there'll be nothing left because the flames were 500 feet from the, our fence line and they were 30 feet high and it was a wall of flames and the wind was blowing to us, towards us. The irrigation saved our property. I thought in the morning if I returned and it was all gone, which is what I thought it would be all gone because it was just raging, <clears throat> that we would zero scape the property and I'd build a little house and I'd have to sell a bunch of horses. And lo and behold, in the morning when we returned, Everything was intact. The fire burned right to the fence line and the irrigation water saved not only my property and my neighbor's property, but I was told later that the firefighters thought it saved all of Missouri Heights because they made a stand at our lands because of the irrigation water. We took our horses at one o'clock in the afternoon. We had eight to, to evacuate and a friend came with a three horse trailer and three horses went to Bob and Sue Petrock's uh, Wonder View Farm. And then I had a three horse trailer and I borrowed a two horse from a friend and we evacuated five horses to Linda Cameron's Eagle's Rise, which is the old moon run, my old home. So we are so pleased that our friends helped us. Um, and then um, Wind Walkers called and Gabrielle Greaves said that she needed to evacuate a lot of horses. So um, we called my ex-husband and he had a 10 horse trailer available and I believe it was Snowmass Creek Outfitters Jeff Groom, who came and showed up and took 10 horses out for Gabrielle. So we were happy to help the best we can. Thank you.